Hi guys, I'm Jasmine here, and um, I'm gonna read you a story. It's more. The book is called "More Scary Stories to, Talk to Tell in the Dark." Yes, I am not in the dark, but I'm in my room with the light on. I'm covering my my phone with the with my lap. And I'm going to read The Little Black Dog. <coughs> Hold on. <coughs> Billy Mansfield said that that little black dog followed him wherever he went. But he wasn't but he was the only one who saw it. So people thought he was kind of crazy to drive the um, dog away. Billy was always hollering at it, throwing rocks at it, but the dog always came back. The first time Billy saw the dog was at the day he thought, fought Sales Borton, Bord, I don't know. Billy was just a young man then, but the Bordens and Billy's family had been feuding for years. When Billy saw Sales riding toward them, he went for his gun and Borton his went back for his, but Billy Fired first, he hit him. He hit Barton in the back, knocking him down from his horse. Barton' horse ran off. His gun fell where he couldn't reach it. He lay there on the ground, pleading with Billy not. Ooh. To kill him, but Billy killed him anyway. Barton's little black dog was with him when he he was shot. The dog kept licking Bart, Barton's face and barking and swirling at Billy in anger. In his anger, Billy killed the dog too. Excuse me? That was so rude. I'm sorry, I hate this one. Okay. There was much law infringement in those days so Billy wasn't arrested but all that night he heard Barton's dog outside his cabin scratching on the door barking to be let in I'm not imagining this Billy said to himself I shot the dog it's dead the next morning Billy saw the dog it was Waiting from him outside. From then on, there was not a day when he he didn't see it, and there wasn't a night when he didn't hear it scratching at his door, barking to be let in. From now, from then on, Billy was always finding a black dog. Here's on his sofa, on the floor, on his bed, even his food. Ew. And the house, the yard, sink of dog. That's what Billy said. Whatever somebody told him, there wasn't any dog to see. He said, maybe you sh don't see it, but when, but I do. And I'm not crazier than you are. Things went on like for for that many years. Then one morning, middle of winter, the neighbors didn't see any smoke coming out of Billy's chimney. When they went over to check Billy's Billy, Billy wasn't there. Or the day. On a day so 
or later. They found his body laying in the snow in the field back of his ca cabin. Billy had plenty of enemies. At first, it seemed like somebody might kill him, but there wasn't a mark on his body. There wasn't footprints about except Billy's. The doctor said Billy probably died of an old age, but there was something odd about his teeth. When the neighbors found Billy, there was black dog hairs on his clothes. There were, were even a few on his face. It smelled like dog had been out there, yet no has seen a dog anywhere. Oh dear. Okay, I'm going to read another one. A short one. Ooh, hoo -hoo. I want to read this one. The Bride. The minister's daughter had just gotten married after a wedding ceremony. There was a great feast with music and dancing and contests and games, even old children game, children games. When they got to playing hide and seek, the bride decided to hide hide in her grandfather's tank up in the attic. They would never find me in here, she thought. As she was climbing into the trunk, she laid down and cracked cracked her head and fell unconscious inside. The sled sh slammed shut and locked. Ooh, shoot. No one ever knew how long she called for help or how she how hard she struggled to free herself from that thumb. Everyone in the village searched for her and they Looked almost everywhere, but no one thought of look. Looking. Why, you know? What? Look. In the in the trunk. After a week, her brand new bridegroom and the others gave up on her loss. Years later, he made went up into the attic looking for something she needed. Maybe it's in the, in the trunk, she thought. She opened it and screamed. There was a missing bride in her wedding dress by then. She was only a scout. Why do you kill my real name? I'm on YouTube! You call my real name while I was doing a video! Well, that's it for guys, and I hope you like this story, like these two stories. Um, I hope you like them, and okay, that's creepy, but okay. I hope you like the like. I hope you like, comment, subscribe, hashtag douche it. Bye.